You have two choices when you're dealing with God. You have two choices. When God brings you out of a dark place, like say you in a real, 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 real dark place. Some people choose, choose to share their dark place, some don't. And that's all right. You ain't got the, it ain't really, it ain't no, it is nobody's business where your dark place was as long as you don't stay up in that dark place. You understand? When you get brought out of that dark place, when God brings you out of that dark place, you got two options. Your first option is this. Run. Run away from that dark place that God has brought you out of far, far away. Your second option is to stay in that dark place. That's the only, that's the, you don't have to, you don't have an option to have your toes in the dark place and your body outside of the dark place. You don't have that. Have you ever been to a haunted house? You don't have the option. If you stand in the door in the gateway of a haunted house, they're going to snatch you in, right? If you stand at the entry of a car wash, it's going to snatch you in, right? When God brings you out of a dark place, no matter what people do to bait you back into the dark place, you got two choices. You can either go back into the dark place, right? Or you can run from the dark place. That's the only two options that you have. So you cannot worry about what people in the dark place. You can't even get out of the dark place and you're worried about me. You can't even get out of the dark place. That's not even the meat and cheese of what I want to tell y'all. Analyzations last week. All right. And we got some people that surround us right now that, that's, that's sending messages for the dark place. They, they work in moonlighting at the dark place. They're smiling in our face, but they're moonlighting in the dark place. And those are the people that you got to get rid of, okay? If your life is going to change, but it can't change when you got people sending messages from the dark place to the light. Because if you really love somebody, one thing about God, God is not going to reveal to you anything that is not intended for you. So if God brings you out of the dark place, he's not going to put your address on something from the dark place and send it to is and send it to your harvest season. He's not going to do that. So when you're receiving mail from your dark place, why are you in your harvest season? That's Satan. That's not God. Those are the people that you got to get out.